Because you started yeah. when you were 16. Yeah, I, I started playing when I was 16, like traveling around. I, I remember the first time I got invited to go to Dallas and play, and that was a lot of fun. Uh, but, you know, I started with you know, five or six horses and no organization, no coach, no trainer, uh, no brand recognition. And, you know, if you fast forward to 2021, Alegria is a well-known polo team everywhere in the world. Um, you know, we can debate its value, but uh, certainly well-known. So and who is that? Alegria. That's my team. Oh, so Alegria, that- means ha- Alegria means happiness in Spanish. And the rose-colored jerseys are our kind of trademark color. It's iconic, isn't it? Like, that's a brand. Wow. Totally. So, you know, I'm, I'm very proud of, uh, you know, a little, uh, little boy from Calgary going all the way to the big stage in Argentina and, and putting, uh, you know, my, my passion for horses and sport, you know, on, on the biggest stage. Did you, did you find that the hot pink really stands up or the rose-colored yeah, I mean, it, it's just iconic. Yeah, wherever I go, I uh, always have some jerseys for fans, and they're like, Alegria, we know that we know that team because of the color. I mean, if nothing else, uh, the color is, is very distinctive. It's, it's a good lesson on marketing and branding because when, when it came to us, we had so many people saying like, yes, this is Alegria. And so we stuck, we stuck with it. And we've seen some uh, other soft pink colors come out now in uh, F1. Alex Stroll? Yeah, and that, that's, a, that's just an amazing coincidence. Uh, you know, Lance, uh, Lance, well done. Yeah. yeah, well done to Lance. I mean, obviously uh, a leader in the Canadian sportsman space. And one day I'd like to meet him. He looks, uh, obviously, he's very, very good. Um, you know, and someone we can all be proud of.